Uh, well, I've been a member since probably the year I got out of the Air Force, which would have been 61. Yeah, but it wasn't. It wasn't here. It was a. It was the Art Association. I think it maybe grew out of the Art Guild, didn't it? Yeah. And uh, they used to have an annual exhibit up at the Courier Times building up on the patio. And in the first year, I exhibited there. And his, his business used to be located next door in the empty lot that's there. Yeah, yeah, so I, I, yeah I, I owned a third generation of buildings. And then it was, it was demolished and became a, a lot next door. They had plans for it to do a, a civic theater type thing. And, and so far, that's not, that's not come to pass. So you're an artist? Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. I don't know. That's kind of a... Yes. He's loose, one of our... Loose term. No, one of our most, most talented local artists. He... Um, so far, we've only gotten to donate one of his paintings to the collection in the other room, but... It is here? Yeah, it's okay, here. We'll but he has... has um, in fact, I've, I've actually spent the big bucks and bought one of his, so... He, he, he's uh, very talented. Yeah, Steve early on, in one of the first exhibits we had here, one of the major exhibits, yeah. Yeah. he bought a painting that I had here, that I, and one of my favorites, actually. It, and it's a, a night scene of the Castle Theater. It's kind of a different painting for me because uh, I usually just do landscapes. But I do like historical sites, especially in, in the county. And this is this is the first time I think I really a, a, attempted a night scene. And it turned out perfectly.